We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of baseball on MLB Network. Time for game two of the regular season between the Louisville Bats and the Columbus Clippers. Now at the plate, Michael Ciani. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. And a good pitch there as this is swung on and missed for the first out of the ball game. Coming to the plate now, Christian Cologne. He'll get to take his first cuts here. And he lays off here, ball four, and he'll become the game's first base runner here with one away. So coming to the plate, Travis Jankowski, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Now the one and one pitch misses off the plate. Cologne leads off first with one away. Softly hit to the left side. There's one. Relay to Bowers, a double play, and that's how the inning ends. Ready now, Brian Rocchio. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The 2 1 home. Popped him up. Stevenson is under it. He's got it one away. So digging in now, Greg Allen. First shot for him here. Two hits in five trips a night ago. 1 1. Fouled away up to the concourse area. The 2 2 one more time. Got a full count. Mike Three, Pappy two. waits on deck. Swing and a line drive. A quick glove at third, and there were two gone. Now batting, Mike Pappy. He went hitless last night in a game where his guys could push across only one score. 1-1 one, one home. One two is an off speed pitch. No dice. It's two and two. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. No pitcher likes to take the count to three and two, especially when you throw. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Derek Dietrich. He drove in one of their two runs in last night's ball game. A 2 2. It's laid off, and the count runs full. Wow, from 0 and 2 to 3 and 2, and that last pitch on 2 and 2 wasn't even close. He had this guy in the ropes, but now he let him right back into this at bat. So he got him swinging. Derek Dietrich becomes the first out of the inning. And he fouls this one off. Still looking for our first hit in the ball game. Curveball hit on the ground to shortstop. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Into the box, Gavin LaValle can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. Open to send him packing, pitch on its way. Ah, had him fooled as he swings through the curveball, two down. At the plate, Tyler Stevenson. Two balls and a strike. A hey, curveball that kind of backed up on him right there. Might have popped out of his hand just a little bit earlier than he intended. Three balls, one strike. The uh, three one. Three two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. And he'll dive back in. No score here as we play inning number two. 
And he misses here for ball four. Already two walks surrendered in his first couple of innings of work. Stepping into the box, Stuart Fairchild. Two's all over the place. Two on, two out, and of course, here in inning number two. They try to come in with the fastball, but it's too far in, and it's even at two and two. Hey, even though this guy's a righty hitter, he's going to get pounded with that two-seamer. He needs to make sure he catches this thing out. And the right fielder is there to make the catch, and the inning is over. Here now is Jake Bowers. He's set to lead off the home half of the second. Now the one-and-one one pitch. Three and one. Well, that sets up a big pitch right here, Matt, because you don't want to lose the leadoff guy in the scoreless game. It's tough to work around the leadoff walk. The three-two pitch. This is in the air out to straightaway center. Siani is there, and he has it for the first out. Into the box now, Daniel Johnson. Bottom of the second here with no score. Swung out and fouled as it looked to make it all the way up into the concourse area. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Inside, he misses ball four. Coming to the plate now, Nolan Jones. Runners on first with one down. He pulls this one into right. In there, a base hit. In now, Mitch Longo. Outside, two and one. Great chance right here as a hitter to be really aggressive. With two guys already on, pretty good shot. He's going to get a challenge pitch right here. Oh, and that's ball three now as it just misses below the zone. A shot down the first baseline. One there. Relay to Dietrich, and they turn the double play. That's how the inning comes to a close. Standing in, Alfredo Rodriguez, and he'll start out their half of the third, top of the order to follow. Little tardy on that swing as it's well wide at first. Line down the left field line, but this is going to get fouled. Hard hit ball to second. Ah, oh, way to get dirty. Wow. Riding in once again, Michael Ciani. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. A 1 1 home. Well hit to right. But a foul ball. Third inning, no score to this point. Pitch popped up, and he'll put this away for the second out. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Christian Colon. He drew a walk his first time up. Here now the 2 2. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. batter will be Mike Freeman. One one. On a line that's a base hit. Stepping in now Bo Taylor. And it's three and two now to the number nine hitter. 
Brian Rocchio will be next. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Digging in for his second at bat, Brian Rocchio, 0 for 1 after a pop out in foul territory his first time through. Yeah, we used to have a saying right here you would stride to the plate for this AB trying to chop wood. Not in today's game. You just want to get your bat plane on the same path of the ball. Can't continue to swing under those elevated heaters. So now to the plate, Greg Allen. And he popped him up over toward the left side of the infield. Rodriguez camps under it, and he's got it for route number two. So striding forward now, Mike Pappy. Two on, two out for him here in the third. Here's the 1-1. He pulls this one into right. That's in there. Base hit. Freeman rounds the corner and is headed home. And they're going to take a 1-0 lead as the run comes across to score. Standing in now, Jake Bowers. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. His pitch count is getting up there in the inning now. He needs to get this frame over with sooner than later, so forcing contact and getting the defense involved is probably the best thing he can do. Hit down the line at first, but this will wind up foul as he runs the count full now. Payoff pitch on its way, and this misses for ball four. The second walk he surrendered here in the first three innings. The batter. Stepping into the box, Daniel Johnson reached base via the walk in his first plate appearance. Too close for comfort, and he did a good job just to make contact. He set the payoff pitch. Got him. So the damage winds up not being as bad as it could have been as they'll strand the bases loaded. This side is retired. Digging in at the plate is Travis Jankowski. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Drops one down here, and he'll try to beat it out. And he fans on the barehanded attempt, so that ought to be scored as a bunt single. The first baseman, number 35. Derek. Into the box now. Derek Dietrich. Oh, a double play ball to second. Four. Six. Three, and they turn the double play. So base is empty now after the double play. And that'll give way to the third baseman, Jonathan India. 1-1. One, one. On a line, that's a base hit. Legs churning, he's headed for second. And he will pull into second with a two-out double. Now back, designated hitter. Gavin. Into the box, LaValle. Gavin LaValle. Taken, and that one catches the bottom part of the strike zone. Sent on the ground out to second. He's got it. And nothing will come of the two-out double as the inning is over. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. Digging in, Nolan Jones, a base hit in his first trip. And this is swung on and missed in this fourth inning. We'll start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout. And there's one away. Now the one and one pitch. Grounded up the first baseline. But this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. Hit hard on the ground to second. And into center field as he's aboard with a one-out single. At the plate now, Mike Freeman. A little bit outside. Two and one. Now a swing and a ball popped in the air back behind short. Rodriguez takes charge out there and he stays with it for the second out. Now in the box, Bo Taylor looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Here's the one-and-one one pitch. 
popped him up. Stevenson is there. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. In now, Tyler Stevenson. He drew a base on balls his first time up. Line to the right side. And this will get through into right, and he's aboard with a single. Now back for left field. Stepping in now, Stuart Fairchild. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. Bowers is there to make the catch for the first out. At the plate, Alfredo now Rodriguez. The doctor, Alfredo Rodriguez. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Runner at first here, one man out. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Into the box, Michael Ciani. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him Michael to this point. Ciani. Line toward the gap in left center. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. Now battle. The second baseman. Hit the plate now. Christian Colon. This is skied into short left center. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. So the lineup flips over and digging in. Brian Rocchio, he singled his last time up. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Hot shot to third. And he's retired here, one away. Digging in now, Greg Allen. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. The 1-1. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Fielded cleanly. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. To the plate now is the designated hitter, Mike Pappy. 1 for 2 on his line so far in the game. Good battle. Count remains full. Good battle here. This will be the seventh pitch coming up. And this one misses high for ball four, and they have themselves a two-out base runner. Justin Schaefer takes over here with the runner at first, and two gone in the inning. Jake Bowers will be the first to greet him here as he stands in with a runner at first, and two away. The one-two. And that one got a piece of him. Digging in to try it again. Daniel Johnson. He went down on strikes last time up. And you can live with punching out with the bases empty. But in his last at bat with two runners in scoring position, you cannot go down not putting the ball in play. Too much on the line. Too many ribby opportunities out there to swing and miss in that spot. Yo. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. That's what you call a challenge fastball right there, boys. I don't know if he was necessarily trying to miss up in the zone like he did, but he got away with it right there. Oh, hold on. What a stop. Just late. He's safe. An outstanding effort that time, but that's a base hit, and the run's in to score. So now to the plate, Mitch Longo fouled off. Ready with the one two got him so the damage winds up not being as bad as it could have been as they'll strand the bases loaded this side is retired. Leading off the inning Travis Jankowski as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. Three one. Hit on the ground to third. 
throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Striding in, Derek Dietrich. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Ready on two balls and two strikes. Here it comes. Lifted the other way to left center. Left fielder is on the move. He makes the play. Really had to hustle to get to that one. Two gone now. Trying to pick things up where he left off. Jonathan India. He doubled his last time through. 1-1. One, one. Two out, nobody on. Just off the end of the bat, it's a foul ball, and he'll stick around. Saws him off here as this ball's popped into the air, and he'll avoid the fragments out there to make the catch that ends the inning. Bottom of the sixth inning now. Digging in, Mike Freeman. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. Hit back up the middle. Scooped up. And there's one down now. Now at the plate, Bo Taylor. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. And he takes ball four. So a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. So striding in, Brian Rocchio. He's working on a one for three thus far. Three and two now. I'll tell you, it's a helpless feeling for a manager or a pitching coach when your pitchers are having a really hard time throwing strikes. What are you supposed to do other than keep trying new guys until someone starts attacking the zone? He throws him on the fastball there. Brian Rocchio goes down for the second out here in the bottom half. Now the one and one pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. But this will land untouched. It's a foul ball off to the left, and it moves to one and two. A swing and a ground ball to third, and he'll go the short way to retire the side. New inning set to get underway. Striding forward now is the DH, Gavin Lavalley. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast? They could certainly use that right now. Now that Standing in now, Tyler Stevenson fouled away. And another foul ball. The one two. Hit hard down the line. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. To two balls and two strikes now. I don't blame the pitcher one bit for trying to get the chase right there. He's been fouling everything off. He's still got the entire arsenal open to him. So we'll see what pitch he comes with next. Swing and a little blooper to center. And that's in there. Base hit. Now batter. The left fielder. In now. Stuart Fairchild. Pops this one up. And that'll drop into no man's land out there for a base hit. And no sense risking anything here as the bases will be loaded now, now with still nobody out. Henry Martinez is summoned in the toughest situation a reliever can face. Bases loaded, nobody out. At the plate now, Alfredo Rodriguez. Oh, and a half swing there on a pitch out of the zone. Indeed, it's strike two. And they'll try to entice him with the change up here, but it dips below the knees. It's two and two. Has a look, now the pitch. And he 
gets him swinging. What a big out there as there is now one away. So stepping in, Michael Ciani, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Trying to fool him with the changeup, but he won't offer at it. Three and two. Looked to me like he tried to do way too much on that 2-2 pitch. You don't have to come into the zone on that count, but a pitch that far outside. And the runner from third crosses the plate. It's now a 2-1 ball game. Now batter, second base. Christian. At the plate, Cologne. Christian Cologne. Her ball bounces, and this one gets away. The runners will hold tight, but it's a full count now, 3-2. Payoff pitch home. High drive deep down the left field line. Gone! It's a grand slam. To the plate now, Travis Jankowski is put in play to the right side of the infield. Reined in. And the off-balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. Ready for another chance. Derek Dietrich. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. And strike three there as they'll finally work out of the inning as this side is retired. Amir Garrett will come on in relief as he'll make his second appearance of the season so far. Amir Garrett. Now to the plate, Mike Pappy. He's one for two in this one. Ready with two balls and a strike. Now a fastball gets the upper part of the zone for strike two. With too much tilt on that breaking ball as it misses low. You know, you don't always have to straight challenge a guy on a 3-2 count. With the three-run lead, no one on base. This is the perfect. And that's a base hit, so the pressure's on to open up the inning. The first base is Stepping in now, Jake Bowers. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Jankowski will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Now that Digging in once again, Daniel Johnson. It was a walk in his last trip. Into the corner and slicing foul. 5-2 our score as we play inning number seven. He pulls this one into right. And that'll get down for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Now that. So now to the plate, Nolan Jones. Two and one. On the ground, back up the box, and it'll get through into center field. A base hit. He'll come home with it. Oh, but it's offline, so the run will score. Now that. Into the box now, Mitch Longo, and it's fouled away. Ready to deliver the one and two. And a fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. Lucas Sims trots in from the bullpen here as he inherits a tough spot with two on and two away. Mike Freeman will be his first assignment here as he'll face him with runners at first and second and two away. Set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. And the pitch misses low and away for ball two. All even now, two and two. And a fastball swung on and hit to second. To first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get out of hand. James Hoyt has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 50. 
leading off the inning, Jonathan India, as they'll look for some added insurance before the bottom half of the inning. Now the one and one pitch is a changeup that's looked at for a ball. Fastball and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. Count remains full. Payoff pitch one more time. Hit out towards second. And into center field, a base hit. So early trouble here to start the eighth inning. Now batter, the designated hitter, Gavin. Into the box, LaValle. Gavin LaValle. A ball and two strikes. Hey, you know in the back of your mind as a batter right here, he's got that nasty sinker. I know it's 0-2, but he might not be looking for the punch out. You have to find a way as a batter to get that two-seamer up in the zone or you're going to ground into a double play. Got him to miss the breaking ball there. Gavin LaValle becomes the first out of the inning. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. This is on the ground over to first. And that'll get on through into right field for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Now that left field. In now, Stuart Fairchild into center field, and that's going to get down for a base hit. And they will hold that runner over at third as he'll move up only 90 feet, now but the bases are loaded with one away. Rodriguez. At the plate, Alfredo Rodriguez. And that misses. Ball four. A run will come in to score. The center field, number so they'll make a matchup move here and bring on a southpaw to face the left-handed hitter due up. Michael Ciani will be the first to meet him here, and he'll do so in an enviable situation indeed. Bases loaded and only one out now. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Right fielder giving chase. He gets there to make the catch, but this should bring home a run as the runner tags from third. Safe at the plate as they tack on one more to make it 7-3 now. Now batter. Second Stepping eight. in, Christian Colon. He's already got Colon. four RBIs in this one. Hey, the difference in this one, they lead by four. Go back to this guy's previous A.B., a towering grand slam that knocked in four runs. The count now at two and one. Line toward the gap in left center. And a dive, but it rattles in and out of the glove. He'll get it into second, but he'll get in there with an RBI double. Now back the right fielder, Travis Jankowski. Standing in now, Travis Jankowski. A bouncer to the left side, fielded cleanly. Throw is in time, and they're able to avoid the huge inning here as the side is retired. Leading off the inning, Bo Taylor. And they'll need him to get something going here. The one two. He's looked at for ball number two. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Left fielder is on the move. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Brian Rocchio, he was sent packing on strikes in his last trip. Yeah, Matty, and he was locked up by a good fastball for strike three last time. I'm interested to see if they attack him the same way. Come at him with hard velo late or snap something off in the dirt to see if he'll fish. Got him to go down swinging there. Brian Rocchio becomes out number two this inning. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. The designated hitter, Mike. To the plate now, Mike Pappy. Two two pitches fouled away. Yeah, 
and it's up to a 3-2 full count now. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. This one's down to third. He's got it. And the off-balance throw gets him as he takes away a hit, and the side is retired. once again Derek Dietrich looking to change his fortunes here 0 for 4 with two strikeouts so far in the game right side defense aligned perfectly and that is into right field so the leadoff man's aboard here to kick off the ninth now back the third base Jonathan India into the box now Jonathan India High and deep to left. This one's got plenty of distance. And goodbye. This one ain't coming back. At the plate now, Gavin LaValle. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Allen is to his left as he puts it away in the alley for the first out of the inning. Now at the plate, Tyler Stevenson. He's working on a three-hit ball game right now. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Man, that's one of those. How could you not swing at that one? A good take there on that pitch. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Digging in and looking for more, Stuart Fairchild. He's two for four in the ball game. Called strike, and he's behind one and two. Now a fastball awfully close, but he doesn't get the call. It's two and two now. Here's the pitch. Alfredo Rodriguez would be next. Ready to deliver the full count pitch. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Johnson is there and he'll make the catch to retire the side. So here's the cleanup hitter, Jake Bowers. These two have not faced each other at the major league level. The 1 1 home. Hit out toward second. Scooped up. And there's one away. Ready for another now shot now. Daniel Johnson, a hit in two official trips to the plate to this point in the ballgame. Lifted in the air to center field. Center fielder on the run. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Stepping up now, Nolan Jones. It was an RBI single for him in his last plate appearance. Change up just off the black, and it's two and one. Rip down the line. And this will stay inside the third base bag. A fair ball. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. Now batter. Longo. Stepping in now, Mitch Longo. And this is sliced hard down the left field line. And that's a fair ball as this will rattle up into the corner. He's in at second safely. As also on the play, a run comes across the to score. At the plate, Mike Freeman. To two balls and two strikes now. Two balls, two strikes. And he takes ball three, so it's a full count now. Now on three and two as a pitcher, you've got to go with the pitch that you feel most comfortable throwing with. And this ball's in the air to left field, and this should do it. 
He makes the catch, and they have earned a sweep here in this brief two-game series as this ball game is over. Yeah, this might not have been what he expected. I'm not sure he expected to have to go seven outs to get the save, but hey, he did, and he iced the victory. Ten to four, the final in this game. The Bats scored ten runs on the way to victory. Justin Schaefer claims the win out of the pen his first. Lucas Sims turns in two and a third out of the bullpen to earn the save his first of the year. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa and the lefty Dan Plezak and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. Thanks for watching MLB Network. Our final line score. First for the victorious bat. Ten runs on 16 hits. No error. They left eight men on base. For the Clippers, four runs, 12 hits, no error, they left.